Well, we're in Milan, Italy. Just got up a while ago. Sound effect. I will scream till the breath is gone from my lungs. I will scream till it's gone. I will leave all the rest of my ghosts behind. I will leave them behind. Another day exploring. Today we're in Milan. Yeah. I'm gonna go see the city, get our tickets. Uh, we're at we're at Duomo right now. I, I'm probably not saying that right, but uh, it's apparently one of the biggest churches in all of Christianity. It's really big and uh, it's pretty cool. In America, we call it Italian ice. Here, they call it like gelato or whatever. But it's way better here. <laughs> when Andy and I travel, we try to walk around ourselves and you know try to try to do stuff locals do. Figure out what they do and do it. <laughs> the backstage life of We Came as Romans is insane. It's also very sleepy. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm partying so hard. Uh, it, it consists of uh, eating snacks. I never pass out. Never. I'm up 24/7. Wi-Fi is like the ultimate party favor. Yeah. If you bring Wi-Fi, if you bring Wi-Fi to the party at a backstage party for We Came as Romans, you're immediately the talk of the whole back of the back lounge, the whole little, the whole little backstage area. You become the cool person of the party, right, Louis? Oh yeah. I get very anxious, um, and I I hate sitting in the same place. I uh, especially if we're in a new country I haven't been to before. Um, I'm always on the train, trying to go somewhere new, trying to sightsee. If Brian, our tour manager, doesn't tell me to stay in one spot, I won't stay. I'll be gone. This is what we're gonna do. I don't need a normal job. It's not a normal job. It's not a normal nine to five. I don't know. I feel like as soon as I am, I'm stuck in a certain place, and I, I'm like almost trapped. It's something that I don't enjoy. That's when I know I've kind of given up on myself, so. I never want to give up on myself. I just always want to keep conquering the things that I dream about and the things that I I like and I enjoy. We Take a shot. Can't wait. Fucking stoked. Lou's so stoked, right, Lou? I'm stoked. I'm excited. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be fun. Rock and roll. One, two, three, get up! When we get on stage, it, it's it's a very heartfelt and a very real thing for us. And that's where the reward is for us. Last 
Tonight was crazy and fun, and people were moving around and crowd surfing, and it, it was sick, man. You guys still suck! Touring in general is just really, really up and down. You get really excited to go on a tour, um, and then you're out on tour, and sometimes you get really excited to go home. I, you know, never did I think over eight years ago that uh, music would have brought me to that point. I didn't think, oh, you know, maybe in a, in a couple of years I'll play to thousands of people. I feel like I have a life that I've always wanted to accomplish and achieve. I think that doesn't involve me being tied down to something that is, is just the normal. Well, like I said, you know, it's so up and down sometimes. You know, you have nights where your girlfriend's mad at you, your family misses you, you miss your sister, your mom, your dad, you know, all those kind of people, and you want to go home. And that's crazy to think, you know, somewhere hours away from where from where we live um, where just years ago we were completely unknown and no one knew who we were and for me that's constantly touring seeing the world meeting kids and seeing things that normal people don't see it's fun for me it's different I guess I hope by the end of the band whenever that uh, that day may come that when people think back of over the course of whatever our, our career as we came as Romans was, was that it was a genuine one.